your host, Amy Cinnamon Clark Smith. Every day is a winding road. I get a little bit closer. Clark Smith Adventures. Uh, this is your host, Amy Cinnamon Clark Smith. I'm on my way to my mother's house. This is all I do on the weekend. I have no life. 43 years old. There is no more club hopping. There is no more hanging out, getting drunk. Because it's not fun when you're 43. You're just like, the next day. So, I hear this song all the time and I absolutely hate it. That stupid song by Sheryl Crow. Every day is the greatest sign. Get a little closer to feeling fine. Dude, she is like the most boring singer on the face of the earth. Like, when I think of Sheryl Crow, I think of people going to wineries and like, yeah, Sheryl Crow is so awesome. Oh my God, she's so great. I used to work in an office and I know I'm white. Actually, I found out I was like 8% Middle Eastern, 5% African or something. But anyway, I'm white. But I know I work, you know, I worked around a bunch of white folks. And they were like obsessed with Sheryl freaking Crow. Like, yeah, dude. Yeah. I'm going to go see her in concert tonight. Like, <sighs> <sighs> Dude, if I went to her concert, you might I might as well bring a damn sleeping bag and go to sleep. Pop a tent, go to sleep, uh, because I would be bored out of my freaking mind. She's like the most boring singer. Everyone's like, oh, Amy Clark Smith. Amy Clark Smith, that's not nice. She's a great art entertainer. She's a great entertainer. She used to, like, sing for Michael Jackson. She's awesome. What's wrong with you, Amy Clark? I'm not saying she's not a good entertainer. It's just, to me, my personal opinion, she's boring as shit. Her songs all sound the same. Her songs are so boring. Like, if you have trouble sleeping, put on one of her songs, and then you'll be like... Yay! I can go to sleep now because Sheryl Crow's on the damn radio. Ugh. That fucking cat scratch right here. It's horrible. People like looking at my face and they're like, Oh my god, what's wrong with her? Um, it's my cat did this shit. My cat. My cat did this shit. So, um, yeah. Yeah. I literally would rather listen to Britney Spears, Celine Dion, and Mariah Carey all at the same time gargling toothpaste. I literally, that I would pay for. I would never pay for a Sheryl Crow concert. Like, I, the only song that I really know is that one that they play constantly. Constantly. You're in the supermarket. You're on the, it's on the radio. It is at the freaking uh, post office. At the mechanic shop, at the Walgreens, at the 7-Eleven. It's everywhere. That every day is the greatest sign. I get a little bit closer to feeling fine. I'm just not. I'm sorry. I'm just not into it. Shell Crow rocks, Amy Clark Smith. You're crazy. Shell Crow rocks. <laughs> Hi, my name is Cheryl Crow. I am so boring. All my songs sound exactly the same. They all sound the same. I sing 5,000 songs and they all sound exactly the same. It's all the same. Cat shirt! Cat shirt! Cat shirt! Cat shirt! This is the most badass shirt I've ever owned. I love it. Anyway, Clark Smith Adventures, I'm driving. See you later. Mwah. Everyone have a blessed Saturday. 
I am sure I will not be listening to Sheryl Crow today. If I do, I will pluck my eyebrows out with my teeth. I will put nine inch nails in my eyelids and hang myself on the side of the building. That's how I feel when I hear her music. I mean, you can like whatever you want. You know, everyone's different. Everyone has their own taste. But I literally would put nine inch nails in my eyelids and hang myself on the side of a building if I ever have to listen to her music. <sighs> Bye, Clark Smith Adventures. Bye. Mwah. Love you.